Vous savez qu'on mourit Et qu'on mourit Very good. Aïe, 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 I want to acknowledge the consortium. Obviously, the consortium here, the PPP Council, those who work in the PPP Council, workers. RDA, the consortium, the concessionaire, the funders, two of whom have spoken here and the concessionaire, if I may call it, call them that way. And indeed, the business people in Chililabombo, in Chingola, Kasumbalesa, Copper Belt, Zambia as a whole, I say the business people, including marketeers, they are business people. As I was seated here, I did give an instruction that the trucks must move I see they've stopped. Why? They must move because that is why this road was done, is to allow the trucks, to allow business to move so we can make money. I said to the Minister of Finance here, <laughs> allow the vehicles to move and the time will be here. Maybe we'll earn an extra one million kwacha as we stand here. That is the name of this new dawn UPND and partners government. That's what we are here to do, to open this economy up. Let me recognize all of the people of Jingola, Chirilabombe, Kasumbalesa, and Copper Belt. All of you, the media, in your great numbers. Thank you very much. I am extremely delighted to be here today very delighted. Allah nin temwa. Nin temwa sana. Nin temwa. Vushe mweta muteme nwe. Ine nin temwa. Vushe mweta muteme nwe. Tumona ama boko nga nga na mutema. Tumona. Na mutema aini. Na mutema aini. File chitika pano visuma. No ma visu ma village tika imwe na mukalipa. Kari bambi na bakalipa apa. Walelo yeshavye muma window, walelo yesheva television, walelo yesha na bakalipa sana. Eh. Hey. Na beka le tondolo. Tubombe. Na beka le tondolo. I am very happy to be here. A message in the Perapan. We must all be happy. Chirilabombe, Chingola, Kasumbalesa must be happy. Copper Belt must be happy. Zambia must be happy. Because when we are happy, we'll do more good things that will make us even more happy. We must be men and women of good spirits. Men and women of good spirits, isn't it? God has laid the opportunity for us to get our spirits recharged. That motivation will allow us to think better, to do greater things even more. So thank you for inviting me to grace this occasion. And I'm coming here having been yesterday in Rwanda. Abena Kopala. Shaft 28, 28 shaft, call it whatever you want, was out of production for over 23 years. And yesterday we lowered that magnificent pump, submersive pump, one of the many. In fact, one of the men in Luansha, but the first in the world. That's what the colleagues were told us yesterday. <laughs> to commence the reproduction or bring back into production of 28 shafts. Who won't 
Nomba ndeo mfuwa wambi balila ndatawe Yupi endita vale bomba Ulevo tu bombe msangoshani mwe bantu Eh hey. Kabi if you were clever You should have done what we commissioned yesterday If you were clever Mwika le tondolo Lekeni tu bombe Luansha will be back Jobs, 3,000 Businesses, marketeers Not a month ago I was here again In Kitwe At a ceremony To get Mopani going And there was already cash in the community you go to Kitwe now, I was in Kitwe yesterday, I learned, I passed through the compounds, but they are running out of the houses and coming by the roadside. Because there is money in Kitwe now. Kitwe Council has money now. It's even paying retirees. <laughs> TikTok, 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 TikTok. Aka chelo TikTok. Aka suba TikTok. Chungulo. No manga to one fee for Valelanda. Shabu wele wele fee. Shabu wele wele. Today you go to Mufurila. I've been Mufurila this afternoon. There is money in the community. Suppliers have been paid, are being paid. Contractors are being paid. Those who had left jobs are now going back to jobs. You heard my colleagues who have spoken. Ndola. Sakanya, Mufurila, Mokambo Road, Chivuluma Road. We are independent MP Mwaicheli. Came to my house after we won and says, HH, I want two things you should do for me. If you do them, I will support you. I said, London boy, fish will ever to Bombay. Two things he says, Chivuluma Road. I said, Chimbinish at Mopani. I will support you. So much I want support ni momba on those two things. We have fixed the two things. Chibuluma is under construction. And very good road, concrete road. Thank you, Bamiropi. We are engineer, Chishin Kasana, the engineer. And it am quiet. So, and Mopani is now open. So I've asked the Koba Belt Minister that tonight I want to speak to my young MP from Ghana to say, boy, I have fixed the two things. So what next do you want me to do? I'm not doing them for you. I'm doing them for the people of Ghana, the people of Kitwe. People of Copper Belt. Today we are here. That's my main message. It's a story we are telling from what we used to say in opposition, what we are doing, walking the talk, fixing the things we said we'll fix. Say the things you want us to do, not for your benefit. Not for your something, but for the people we are going to work on those issues. That's why we are elected into office. Epela, ndita mkwai. Abena chingola, abena chiriabombwe, abena kasumbalesa. Let us work together. Mwiumfa vya kumfa umfa. And Kabuswe says something I never expected him to say today. Mala Zuma. What is Zuma Wari Amam Common? Hey, Kalomban. Can you clap for Kabuswe? Clap for Kabuswe.
Qual é a boca do Zé? Kabuzwe came to Shimunenga ceremony in Mala in Mala. He also came to my our little ranch, Naminwe Ranch. And I didn't realize he was picking the themes, the culture of the people there. By the way, I'm a headman in the area he's talking about. Mala Zuma, what a Zuma Wadi Amankoman. It encapsulates the culture of those people about work and hard work. And if you work hard, the opportunities are there. If you don't work hard, you eat the worst food called mankomon. It even picks your lips to remind you that you must work hard. Thank you, Minister Kabus. Kabuswe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But that's a culture we want the whole country to adopt. To work hard like the work you are seeing here. I don't want to keep on talking. Good things have been said. Good things have been said. Yeah, Tata Yakasanga and Mr. Mbambiko, you have nailed it. You have nailed it. People are arguing that why use pension money on a road like this? Minister, you, you really hammered it. Why use pension money? Look, we are saying we want to partner. Four things we've been saying. Partner with global capital and skills. Two, technology. Here it is. I was watching how the vehicles are passing here and the charging system. If the person at the counter cheats the system, the IT will see them. That, hey, never send that to Motumu. Number three, we said partnerships. Why do we want partnerships? We want to share in the risk, we want to share in the benefits. So partnership includes suppliers, contractors. Uh, Minister of Finance, you were right. People pretend to be educated when they were spending years sitting in class, but they didn't learn things there. They didn't learn things. Part of the contracts, the goods we want to provide is a money. So when there's a return on this project, we can basically have a claim on the profitability that comes out of Chingola Chirilabombe Kasumbalesa Road. That's the issue. If we didn't do that, the money will return to where it came from. Minister of Finance, you were right. And my two colleagues were right. You nailed it. These will also make sure that they supervise this project, when government can now take its attention to free education, to CDF, to other things, we will have our own partners monitoring the performance of this project. That's it. Now I hear, oh no, why is pension fund, what are they doing there? This is why they're here. They were created to invest for the pensioners and get a return, then they can pay the pensioners when the pensioners need to be paid. I'm only repeating what has been said. Because the Minister of Finance is always soft, nice and soft. So I'm just rubbing it in. I'm rubbing it in. That's the issue. Let me not say more. What else do I want to say today? I want to say post-debt restructuring, PPP Council. We want more of the Chingola, Chirilabombe, Kasumbalesa Road, like projects. We want more of this. Yes, Ndola Rusaka. Yes, Ndola Sakanya Mufrila Mokambo. Yes, yes, others. But we want at any point in time to have 100 or more of such projects going on at the same time. That's what we want. Then you are going to see the effect of that on the economy. And each one of those hundred plus will be self-contained. They will be delivering profits. They will be delivering jobs. They will be delivering contracts. Hundred multiplied by what you see here. What will happen to this economy? It will be flying. Mm. No, Vancoma. Quiet. Quiet, quiet. <laughs> Dr. Mwenda, 100 multiplied by this investment. So how much money will be sunk in this economy? 
So much. How many jobs will be created? So many. How many suppliers will be benefiting? So many. That's where our attention is going to now. Post debt restructuring, this is our business, core business. Day to day, this is what we'll be doing. That's my second message. My third message, whenever we have a project like this, let us give contracts, subcontractors to Zambian firms, Zambian firms, Zambian individuals. Even to make tea during construction, we must get the Chilabombe marketeers to be the ones providing tea at sea time on the construction sites. They too can make money. Then you see the country change. Country will be something else. We have big ideas for Zambia. We have great ideas for Zambia. But some are disturbing us every day by TikTok, TikTok, TikTok all the time. Let's ignore the noise. Abena Chingola, Abena Chilidabombe, Kasumbaleza. Let us ignore the noise. Let's stay focused. Let's just work. Mala Zuma, Wata Zuma, Waliaman Koman. As Minister Kabozwa said, it's not abusive, it's a motivation statement. Lastly, I want to repeat what the Minister of Infrastructure said. All the ministers, all the departments, all the government institutions, even private sector, whenever you do a project, do it at the right cost, please. We can save that excessive abuse of resources and take it to another project. Right cost. Number two, quality must be right. Three, deliver on time. Then the whole economy will pick up. With those words, it's my honor, singular honor, to declare the Chingola Chililabombe Kasumbalesa Road plus the accessories including this Concola Toll Plaza officially open. Thank you to the people of Tililabombe, Chingola, Kasumbalesa for your patience. First, for your decision to elect us into office to allow us to serve you in this manner like this road. This is the vote you gave us. It's your vote which is working. Thank you for that decision. On the 12th of August, 2021, we couldn't enter this place to campaign. It was tear gas, it was stones, but you still voted for us. You still voted for Murumendo Kaboswe, Najipoka, and that mayor there. And this president, your servant who is talking. Mukwaitu ato tela, just for that. Secondly, for your patience. You've been patient because the people who have been talking, they've wanted you to go in the streets to riot against our government. But you have been patient. Please continue with your patience. You can see the rewards. Thank you.